Let's make some cookies. We have made these, I know, two times at least on here, but I have gotten so many followers, and why not share this wonderful recipe for Disney World's most famous chocolate chip cookies? And a lot of you know, they are amazing. So first thing you do is preheat your oven to 330. Yes, 330. Then in your mixing bowl, I'm using my KitchenAid, you put in 10 tablespoons, which is one stick and a little bit, of real room temperature butter. So we're gonna, there, my oven's ready. We're going to put in our 10 tablespoons of butter. To that, we're gonna add one cup of packed light brown sugar, dump her in there, and three fourths cup of powdered sugar. We're gonna beat it up and get it nice and creamy, probably for a good minute or two. Now that that is beat and it's creamy, we're gonna add two eggs, and I just add mine in at the same time on this recipe. There's another recipe I have to where you literally add one at a time, but this one, you just throw them in there. This is easy and it's good. So beat that for another good 30 seconds or a minute. And always remember, scrape your bowl. Let me show you what it's supposed to look like. See that? Perfect. Now. Let's go get our dry ingredients ready. In my bowl, I have two and one half cups of all-purpose flour, one teaspoon of baking soda, and a half a teaspoon of salt. And I'm just gonna dump it. We're gonna start off on low because you know we don't want that cloud of dust because I've already mopped twice today and I really don't want to do it for a third time. So mix this up really good. While that's mixing, getting happy, add you in two teaspoons of vanilla. You know I don't measure. I just go until my heart says man to stop. So if you wanna follow the recipe, it says two teaspoons. Keep mixing. Scrape them sides. All right, this is what your dough looks like. Nice and good. But you know what? We're gonna add 12 ounces of chocolate chips. This is what I'm using. I'm using Ghirardelli some And I almost lost a chocolate chip. That'd been a bad day, wouldn't it? My theory is this, I did lose two. If you're gonna make Disney World chocolate chip cookies, why not use the best chocolate there is? No brainer. And they are on sale right now at the Kroger's for $4.99 a bag. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. And let me tell you something, my family knows when I cheap out and use off-brand chocolate chips. They're like, not the same, mom, not the same. And they write, but we're bougie on a budget and I only buy the good stuff when it's on sale. So we're gonna mix this up. <laughs> I need some muscle power here. And we're gonna bake them on 330, 12 to 14 minutes. I'm gonna scoop them out with my ever so lovely Pioneer Woman cookie scooper. I love the Pioneer Woman. I watch her every day and every Saturday morning. My husband does too. We've been to her ranch, we've been to her merch, we've been to all of her stuff. I absolutely love it and I cannot wait to go back. I have so many memories. I'd love to meet Reed Drummond one day because she is my hero and she's fixing big grandma. She's gonna know how all the good stuff feels. All right, you get the drift. Scoop them, drop them. By the way, this is the best cookie dough you ever eat in your life. Looky here, y'all. 12 minutes, 12 minutes. These are good. They're hot, and you know I'm gonna pull one off and I'm gonna break it in the middle and I'm gonna let you look at it. That's all we're gonna do, right? Any, mini, mini, mo, which one do we want? This one. Look at the back. That's a chef's kiss right there. You ready? Burn my fingers. Woo! Look at that hot baby. That's why my finger was a burner. These best thing chocolate chip chocolate chip cookie you ever eat we're gonna take that bite mm. I usually hide them and let them cool for about 30 minutes because the edges are crispy and the metals gooey perfect cookie so mm -hmm. I want to do your barefoot neighbors dance Mm. that's what I'm talking about. Yes, he's my favorite. All right, y'all go make Disney World Floridians 
chocolate chip cookies. You will love me forever and ever and ever. I'm gonna eat the rest of that. This makes about, depending on how big or little, 48 to 60. If your kids don't eat your cookie dough while you're making it, which happens in this house. I might be guilty too. I don't know. All right. Go love your family. I love y'all. Open up. You know you want to bite. See y'all. Love you.